Hello and welcome back to this first collaboration vlog of 2021. I'll put a link at the end of the video to all the other um, YouTubers in this collaboration. Please uh, take a look at those uh, videos and subscribe and give them a watch. This week's subject is five tips for saving money in a caravan. Now I thought I would do this a little bit differently and look at um, ways that we have over the years um, learnt and learnt how to save money uh, while we're caravanning in order to spend more money on trips. My sure. first top tip is for caravan insurance. Now it's advisable that you have caravan insurance. It's not mandatory, it's something that you don't need to have, but I would recommend that you get that for your caravan. It protects you and it also protects other people as well. So my tip for this, when we first got our caravan, in, we went to the caravan club for our insurance because we were members of the caravan club and we thought that was the best place to go. Uh, don't get me wrong, it is a really good package and the Caravan Club do offer a really good service but there there are other cheaper alternatives uh, and you can get the same amount of cover uh, as you can from there. So what I'm trying to say is if you're getting caravan insurance, shop around, don't just go for the first quote or for the, the bigger company because you think they might be better. Uh, have a good look around all the different insurers, go on comparison websites and just have a look. We are now covered with Cover for Caravans uh, and they are, they've been fantastic. We've got a very competitive price and from our first caravan insurance, it's probably about £300 cheaper. Uh, I was a bit naive, like I said, when I first bought it and I just went to the caravan club. So yeah, first tip is shop around for your caravan insurance. Don't always go for the, the biggest ones. There are other great companies out there. The second top tip I've got for you is having your caravan service regular. Now we have ours done every 12 months, uh, round about May time or just after. And in, if you keep on top of that and you keep your caravan serviced, it's going to last you a lot longer. It's going to save you money in the long run. And also you're going to make sure that everything's working fine. Also for a safety aspect, you want to make sure everything's uh, safe and working correctly on the caravan. So yeah, make sure you have it serviced every year because in the long run that will save you money. Third top tip is when you may be doing some jobs on your caravan and you're looking for parts, maybe fixtures or fittings. What I tend to do is go on the manufacturers and look for the actual part or the part number. And then I will search the internet uh, to find if I can find it or source a cheaper part. There is Leisure Shop Direct. Um, there's quite a few other small uh, independent caravan dealers that you can get them from or if you want to go you can go to ktg caravans and they do reclaim parts they basically strip caravans down so you can get you know cheaper parts from there so in terms of saving money on maintenance in terms of fixing things yeah shop around don't just get it from the manufacturers there are cheaper alternatives out there fourth tip for when you're caravanning now this is for uh maybe if you are new to caravanning or if you've been caravanning for quite a while is if you're going to a dealer or um you know you're buying a new or new to you caravan is be cheeky um that's going to save you money if they've got a four court price as you would with a car barter with them uh, try and get the price not down don't take it that the price that's on the window is a price that you're going to pay um, try and get something for free things are not for free but yeah just try and uh, barter with them uh, i know when we've bought our you know our caravan that we've got now i noticed that it wanted tires changing and um, i asked them to change them before i would buy that and there's a few other little bits and bobs that I needed doing. So yeah, if you're going to buy a caravan and you want to save a bit of money, be cheeky with the dealers. Uh, they're out there to make money out of you, but let's see if you can get some money out of them so you can save money that way by being a little bit cheeky. Fifth and final tip is one that Angela always says to me is don't buy cheap because if you buy cheap, you buy it twice. We've done this quite a lot of times in the past. Uh, well, I've done it and Angela keeps saying to me, why have you done that? is uh, if, if you want something and um, there is a cheaper alternative, yes, do your research. Sometimes they can be good, the cheaper alternatives, uh, but if you uh, if it lasts you six months and then you're buying it again, you've, you know, you've already paid the, the full price that you would have done. So, yeah, the fifth tip there is don't buy cheap. Make sure you, you buy a decent product. So that's it, five top tips to help you save money while you're caravanning. Please take time to look at the other um, videos in this collaboration. I'll put a link down below and I'll also put a link up at the top at the end for you to click them. Please give them a watch and a subscribe. Uh, thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe uh, and I will see you soon. Take care.
Bye-bye.